So today I have a one more AI tool for you guys to make the consistent character. And this AI tool is not just limited to the images of a consistent character. You, you can even make videos. You can use it for face swapping even in the images or in the video section. So what's this AI tool is? Let's find out. All right, so this AI tool is called apop.ai and this is their website. Well, I have already covered this AI tool in my previous videos, but now they came up with some new and unique features that we're gonna discuss in this video. So basically this tool was designed to make the AI influences and the consistent characters as I have already shared this tool. And these are some of the characters that I have built inside of my workspace. And if I scroll down even further, you can see some community models. So you can also get some inspiration from these images. Now to build your own character, you have to click on this create portrait model. And here we have two options. Even you can upload the image of your character, or if you want the APOB AI to build a character for you, you can go with the AI influencer generator. But I would like to go with my own image. So I'm gonna upload my image. And from here, let's say I want this lady as my character. So after uploading the image, hit save button and now you just need to name your character so let's name it like Anna and then if you want to write the description for your character it all depends on you and now hit create your image model now and after some kind of loading you will have this interface in front of you so you can see this is our model and if you want to change the name of your model you can even change this later on and if you want to make your model public or private you have this option now if i scroll down you can see here we have a couple of options here so you can see build your own complete set expert option we have the video face swapping we have the image face swapping then we even have image to video and talking avatar so we're going to try all of them later on but first of all let's try to generate some images so as you can see we have some pre-generated templates or pre-generated filters here so let's say i want to use this realistic so I would like to go with the realistic one. Then if you want to choose the location, we have some pre-made locations like the private jet, uh, church, bustling city, uh, train station, gym, library, whatever you want to choose. So let's say I'm going to go with the bustling city. And then we even have some nature and landscape filters here. And next we even have the option to change the age of our character. So let's say I'm going to go with the middle age. And next we have the clothing. So you can select the clothing according to your preferences. Let's go with the casual one like hoodie. And now in the prompt bar, I'm going to type prompt like a woman wearing a business suit walking on a street and then scroll down and hit generate. All right. So these are the output images and look at that. These are very stylized images. And personally, I really love this look. And you may be thinking that we mentioned the business suit but this woman is wearing a very casual dress and this is because we have selected the casual dressing at the beginning but in this image you can see it tried to merge the casual and formal look very beautifully but you can easily resolve this issue by just changing the clothing style now if you don't like these pre-generated templates you can just go ahead to the expert option and you can just type the normal prompt that we always do in other ai image generators so let's type any prompt like a woman wearing a red jacket and glasses sitting at a coffee shop and if you want to enter any negative prompt it all depends on you but let's hit generate all right so these are the output results and look at that the woman is wearing the red coat she's sitting in a cafe or some kind of a coffee bar yes we have some issues with the eyes in some of these images just because of the uh, reflection from the glasses but it gave us four different variations so you can select the best in all of them now next we have its video face swapping feature so just click on the video face swapping and now we have to upload our video so let's say i'm going to use this video that i generated inside of the video ai so basically this is the AI generated video and now you can see it gave us four different options high best and ultra so if you select the ultra quality obviously it's going to cost you more credits but if you are okay with the low quality you can go with the high quality but i would like to go with the ultra and hit generate all right so this is the output video and you can see it doesn't only swap the face but it also improved the video quality so here's the before and after so you can see both of these videos side by side so the output is really very impressive now let's try its image face swapping so i'm gonna use this image and simply hit generate all right so this is the face swap version and you can see it didn't even face swap the image but it also enhanced the quality well if you want to upscale this image even further you even have the built-in option so you can just click on this hd icon that means upscale and this will enhance the image even further now let's try its image to video option that is one of my most favorite feature so we have two options you can select the image from your ai generated content and you can even upload your own image manually so let's select any image from our content so let's say i'm going to use this image and hit generate all right so this is the output video 
and we have very subtle smile on the face and you can also notice some kind of movement on the background even though the background is blurred and this is only 3 seconds long video but the video is really very good now let's try something else like this image and hit generate all right so this is the output video again we have very subtle movements on the face not too much but it looks very cute we don't have any issues with the eyes the woman is kind of blinking her eyes and there is no issue with that now let's move on to the last feature that is talking avatar so again you can select it from your content or you can upload your own image so let's say i'm gonna upload this image just as a reference and next we have to upload the audio file so you can upload maximum three minutes long audio file so i'm gonna upload this audio file that i have generated with the 11 labs and let's see what it comes up with so here is the output this is the lip sync feature testing what do you think about this let me know in the comment section so the lip syncing feature works really really good even though uh, the teeth wasn't even available in the initial image but it automatically generated the teeth and the lip syncing feature works very very good here. So this was the quick go through of the APOB AI so you can generate the consistent characters, you can face swap your character, even make the videos of your character, you can use the image to video option, you can even use the talking avatar feature. And in the free plan you will get 80 credits for free on a daily basis. But if you want to upgrade to their premium plan, they offer multiple plans like uh, one is starting from the $5, then $15 and $40. So it all depends on you which one do you want to purchase or if you want to go with their free plan, it all depends on you. So that's it from today. I hope you guys learned something new and if you guys did, do give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.